I think this is one of those tools that we're going to use and will hopefully grow and we'll look back and say, I don't know how we got along without this. Why do we wait so long? Maine is in the forefront of a patient-centered medical revolution that is improving health care. Maine doctors and others who are deeply committed to improving the quality of patient care have collaborated to create Health InfoNet, an independent nonprofit organization. This unique public-private partnership is a highly secure electronic health information exchange designed to give caregivers the patient data they need when they need it most. Our objective really is to try and present a very concise, very quick, very, very extensive view so that someone can make a informed decision very quickly. The system does not provide an entire patient record. Instead, it's a concise but comprehensive presentation of patient medications, allergies, lab reports, and other current vital data. Doctors and other clinicians are discovering multiple uses for Health InfoNet in caring for patients in main emergency rooms, primary care practices, at the bedside, and even in a place like a remote intensive care unit. The Health InfoNet database now contains more than half of Maine's population of 1.3 million people and is used 24-7 by hundreds of medical care teams to make better informed decisions. The system cannot be fully effective, however, unless more clinicians acquire electronic medical records and begin using Health InfoNet. Here's an example of how it works. As I said, once I'm in the patient's main medical center health record, I can be on Health InfoNet in less than 30 seconds. I remain within Sunrise Clinical Manager, and now I'm logging into Health InfoNet. I don't need to change, uh, I don't need to log out of the system. What we have here is, is a demographic page that will show up right away, and perhaps one of the most important pieces of information, the patient's allergies, will immediately show up on the screen. I can look at laboratory information, and there's, as you can see, a large amount of laboratory information here. So, for example, uh, a, hemoglobin, a value of a hemoglobin on a particular date, I can pull that up. This may be a test that was obtained yesterday in a physician's office, or it may be a test that was obtained uh, at another emergency department this morning, but I have access to all this information. And this is really, I think, the beauty of the Health InfoNet. So, even if this patient's lab test was done in Bangor yesterday, and the patient was in the emergency department at Franklin Memorial Hospital in Farmington this morning, the information is available when the patient is admitted to Maine Medical Center tonight. Timely, efficient, and effective information sharing was unheard of until Health InfoNet went online. Our objective is to make sure that when a person moves between hospital and office, or hospital and hospital, that they have a consistency of information that today frequently gets lost. Health InfoNet has been recognized as a national leader in this technology by the president's top health IT advisor. They're going to be, I would expect, among the states that teach us the most about how to do this nationally because they're actually going to be not just planning it, but doing it. All across Maine, a growing number of doctors, nurses, public health officials, and others are using Health InfoNet. It's very quick, much quicker than other systems that I've used for medical records access. We had a patient in our Waterville emergency department who just had cardiac surgery, showed up in the emergency room 11.30 at night. We didn't know what procedure was performed, what his laboratory data was like, and it was just before Health InfoNet went live. So what we had to go through to get signatures, faxing, phone calls, to get his health records took about an hour. About a month later, a very similar patient came into the Waterville Emergency Department, and it was about the same time at night, Friday night. Health InfoNet was live. We were able to just sign in there and get all the data we needed within five minutes. From my experience with it, it's the most helpful when I'm looking for a medications list on a patient. The patient I just saw, it just came out of that room across the hall. She had been in the hospital last week and had a colonoscopy, a CT scan, a number of labs. And some of that had been sent over, but not all of it. And with her in the room, I was able to open up Health InfoNet and look at her biopsy results and look at her labs and get additional information that I didn't have in the chart. This morning, I got a referral from Maine Med, but I was able to go in and see that the very same patient had um, a couple of admissions to Franklin Memorial. 
some an, an admission to CMMC and see um, what had been going on with that person over a period of time, which helps us make the decision about appropriateness for our program. Sometimes there's emergency medicines that we need to give and some people are allergic to those medicines. With health the phone net, you can pull it up and there it is. The medication reconciliation portion is, is probably the most useful for me. To have a central place where I can get an actual accurate medication list and allergy list is, uh, is very uh, time effective for me. The medication list in Health InfoNet is probably the most comprehensive medication list that you can find in the state of Maine. With Maine Care coming on board, we're able to get all the medications that are either e-prescribed or have been filled at a pharmacy and paid for through a pharmacy benefit management or through pharmacy insurance. The automated collection and reporting of data is a key benefit of Health InfoNet. This feature helps lift a time-consuming burden from clinicians so they can focus on what they do best, patient care. The state would like to have 72 different infectious diseases reported so that we can follow up in case there's any prevention activities. We know that that's very hard sometimes for clinicians to do that. Health InfoNet is beginning to collect that information. You really need to sign on to Health InfoNet and look for that, uh, what I'll term an aha moment because you'll find it very quickly. Having you know, essentially instant access to medical records is, is a great thing. I'm ecstatic that we have Health InfoNet in the state of Maine and that uh, we have the opportunity to uh, make it a statewide venture. The learning curve is zero. If, if your IT department builds it into your record, there is no learning curve. It's, it's as simple as pulling up your own data. We as physicians want to do what's right for the patient. That's the core of the physician value system. And the use of Health InfoNet is right for the patient.